Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Chernobylite. This will be part, I don't know, four? Four of our Let's Play? In the last episode, I was just trying to kind of look for, well, I guess that. Um, just whatever that marker is to say that it's... I oh, yeah, that was in the tunnel, right? So it's like a tunnel between those two pools. Um, whatever that sort of secret thing was there that we couldn't find, we really need an anti-Chernobylite burner. Um... Don't know where we're gonna get it, but meanwhile, uh, we are we are done here. Oh, whoops, we are we are done here. Let's go back to base. Now I don't imagine we're gonna have too much like base building to do. Um, this was just a, a food trip, and we didn't actually get that many materials. We did kill some fools, which was pretty fun. We straight up iced them, just shanked one really bad, and just blam. Uh, Olivier, how'd you go? Success! Oh, you got more ammo. You absolute legend. Okay. Um, I'll have a normal food ration. Uh, same as Igor. So you got 3.8 of those left. We've got 1.5. Nice. Very, very good. Except, let's go. Yeah. We did get a bit irradiated. That is the thing that we did. Ooh. Why is it red out there? It's a bit bit odd. Uh, we did get another skill point, but I can't really spend it just yet, so I'm not gonna worry. Why are you all flickery? Oh, is this because we don't have enough power? Isn't that a thing that we did? Right, a power, right? Yeah, power excess. Uh, can we build another one? We can build another one. Okay. I reckon we just cram it in this corner. Uh, can we fit one here somewhere? No, okay. We'll put it between this stuff. So we'll just go bam. Like that. Boom. We've got our power surplus. Can we go to the next level just yet? No. Okay, so actually, what do we need to make? So it's radiation decontamination shower, radiation simulator. Okay, cool. Um, I think it was Igor's inventory and crafting tools. Ooh, we could build a laboratory. Roller bending machine we have, yeah? No, we don't have that. Is it the synthesizer? Produces Chernobylite, anti-Chernobylite burner. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we need Chernobylite powered tools to get that. Gee, how are we going to manage that? Okay. Sorry, what do we got here? We do not have a stove. Let's build a stove. Uh, we'll put it like over in this sort of, you know, homey area. Nice. And uh, I guess we've got a laboratory. Produces first aid, anti rads, alcohol, and rich adrenaline. I don't think we need that. Produces gas masks and gas mask filters. Now that is something that's a bit more useful. I reckon we chuck it right here. Uh, everyone's a little bit unhappy because that's here, so we'll see if we can just... I think we're going to be out of out of stuff. Uh, actually... Hang on. Can I... Alcohol and whatnot. Are we pulling these materials out of here? Hang on, so I have 1.1 and 0.8. So if I build something, how much how much flammable materials do I have? 1.9, okay, so it is pulling it out of both. That's good to know, it means I won't waste my time. Uh, Combain Comfort. Uh, we can build some lights. Uh, put one... Actually, we'll put one up here with the, with the table. Just put like one there. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Reflector. Uh, that will increase my comfort by a ton. Now, which way is this facing? It's facing that way. So I reckon we just turn it that way, like so, and we chuck it right here. Boom. 
Oh yeah, look at that. Plenty of light to work by. Okay. So that's everything in the positives. Let's see what we can do here. The big question will be, can I... I guess, can I craft a gas mask first? No, I need... I need mushrooms. Shh. Oh, mushrooms. That's what I want to make my gas mask out of. Okay, more importantly, can we make any of this stuff? I get the feeling it's going to be all flammable materials. Flammable parts. Or mushrooms. Yeah, okay. So there's a lot of flammable parts required for upgrades. So I think we need those. I mean, we could just put like a side on it. Close red dot sight, open red dot sight, sniper scope. <laughs> Seems a bit excessive. So could get the close red dot sight gives us more stability, but I think we're okay. I think we're fine. Uh, I could put up more walls, couldn't we? Do we have that crap? Walls, wooden walls? No, we need more mushrooms. Fair enough. Uh, we'll just store some junk away, so we'll... Uh, transfer... I'm not used to using a primitive armor or camouflage armor. Okay, sure. Uh, mechanical parts, yes. So much ammo. Actually, wow, so much ammo. Uh, yeah, we'll put some revolver bullets away. Chemicals, I'll put the food away, put the herbs away. More bullets. Uh, you know what, that's okay, we'll put that away. Put that away. I think we're good. What was this? Oh, yeah, that's our workbench. Gotcha. Uh, yeah, we'll just go to sleep and pick up again in the morning, I guess. Yes, please. Oop. We got into the dreamlands again. Nope. We're just awake. Where's... Processor unit. Okay. Cool. Um, well, we're gonna have to go do stuff. Olivier. All right, Igor. What's next? Ah, uh, that's all. All right. To sign some missions. What do we want? I don't think we need ammunition. Um, although Olivier is like best at getting ammo. It's very annoying. Oh, it's a red forest. That's what the red thing is out there. How did I not notice that before? Um, yeah, so we've been to Pripyat Central like a million times. Don't think we need more bullets. Do we go hack into the NAR servers? Maybe? Yeah, Olivier, why are you so good at getting ammo? I guess you're like a soldier. Okay, do we go for the Moscow Eye immediately, or do we just get more food in the Red Forest? I think if we finish the Moscow Eye, we'll unlock the Moscow Eye for more, like, stuff. And although I am a bit sad. Hang on, can I make... Can I make, uh, what is it, like the anti-sadness meds? Uh, what is it? It is calming salts. I need mushrooms. I think we're going to the Red Forest. Uh, I feel like the Red Forest is going to be full of mushrooms and herbs. So let's go and get a food drop. I guess we could go to Kapachi. Our routine food supply will drop in our trees made in the Kapachi area. Coming in contact with the enemy is highly probable. So I think just, it shouldn't be hard to seize it. Okay, we'll do that one. Yeah. Boom, let's go. We'll go to a new area, have him into the red forest. I'm interested to see, because obviously like Stalker is very, like it's very urban, or at least, I don't know, urban rural type deal. Like there's a lot of buildings and a lot of your bigger set pieces are in inside buildings or in alleys and stuff. So I'm interested to kind of go into like the red forest where it's definitely not gonna be that way. Uh, how do I set this? I think we need to set it to mushrooms, <laughs> to be honest. 
All right, I'll take that. How's the map of this one look? Wow, that's a big map. Okay. Something just ahead of me. Anything around? No. I'm just going to set it to mushrooms. Nice. Nearly missed that. Everything's so creaky. Um, that's some Chernobylite. Oh, that's some dead NAR soldiers in Chernobylite. The hell is that? What did that like capture their death or something? It's kind of fun. Anything good? Mushrooms? Mushrooms. Um, okay, do we just, like, s kind of... Ooh, there's a lot of good stuff here. Where's the actual drop? That way. I think we go this way first. And then from here we go elsewhere. I hate the sounds behind me. Like, stop creaking. It's so weirdly sudden. Wow, there's not as many mushrooms here as I was hoping. If I'm being honest. Okay, I see some Chernobylite up ahead. This game looks amazing, though. No doubt about that. Ooh, there's something green over that way. Or is that the edge of the map? Oops. Yeah, I think that's going to be the edge of the map. Okay... I am suspicious. You're next. Oh, Jesus, okay. Oh, was that actually the thing screaming for help? Oh. Well. God, what the hell happened here? Like, what's with all the dead NAR guys wrapped up in... Bloody... Chernobylite. Okay, sure. And what's over here? Not a lot of enemies so far. Although, to be fair, that's kind of this game in a nutshell. I'm, I'm very much guessing it gets a lot harder. Where I'm probably very much going to have to choose between, like, stealth and killing people. At the moment, I just kind of lazily decide, depending on how I feel at the time. Can I get over the fence here? I should be able to, but I can't. Okay. That's fine. So that's what, like, uh, a sealed off sort of village thing? It's fun. Oop. <coughs> Navigate to mushrooms? Hello? Okay. No, maybe that is within the map. Maybe it's over there. That looks very close. I'm a bit, uh, a bit leery. Oh, yeah, there's dust definitely within the map. A bit leery of this place. What's in here? Oh, come on, let me in the fun, like, ghost town thing. Why can't I get inside you? Oh, I've never wanted anything in so bad in my life. Oh, why can't I get in there? Must open up later, I guess. I probably should be doing the... Like, the wipe the NAR servers thing, because I think it's a... feels like a story mission. 
feels like it's kind of what I have to do next. God. Oh, uh, is this what I'm going to need the gas mask for, maybe? Because that definitely looks like it's, it's over here, for sure. Thanks, I'll take that. Oh, yeah, no, that is absolutely over there. Nice flammable parts. We know we need those. God, we really need mushrooms too, though, which is really, really dumb. And also, you know, yeah, fair enough. So is this... No, okay, it doesn't want me to go that way. Fair enough. Understandable. Good day, sir. God, it's it's out there though. Haven't seen any actual NAR. Whoop. <laughs> Haven't seen the NAR soldiers except for like that one. I guess. Okay, I'm gonna just sneaky sneak over here. Nope. Don't you see me? I guess I could just blow his head off, couldn't I? He doesn't look like he has any friends. No, he doesn't doesn't look like he's got any friends. I guess I could also just like rip his rip his throat out or what the hell I do. Yeah, so my psyche and my radiation hasn't actually recovered. So I'll have to be careful not to, you know, die. I'm just gonna borrow this. I appreciate ya. Yes, thank you. I know I've got two skill points. Let me run. Okay. Can we go in here? Ooh, we can go in here with a lockpick. God, I really need to get the lockpicks. You know, I feel like we're missing out on just a whole pile of stuff. Must be inside. Good around here. It's hard to tell whether that green, like, gas is getting closer or not. Ooh, something over here. Oh, I hear crying. You're not real, are you? You dead. Buddy? He's dead. Yes, thank you. Thank you, creepy voice. We knew that was going to happen. Can I have, like, the chunk of Chernobyl in his face, though? Give, 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 give. Ah, oh, like, I'll, I'll pull it out. It's just got a bit of blood on it. It's still good. I like this map, though. It's kind of fun. Uh, yeah, we're going to go down there. I think... I don't know. I'm still kind of deciding on my opinions in this game. I do like the vibe, but at the moment it kind of looks like this game's vibe is sort of all it's got. You know? Oh god, it's a basement. Which I need an anti chernobylite burner for. I'm guessing I'm going to get, like, let me through. I'm guessing I'm going to get one of those at some point. Like, I bet you I'll get... Oh, he's there. Jeez, he was, like, right in front of me. Has he got a friend? No. Ah! Oh, finally, some mushrooms. Maybe I need to be growing mushrooms, because they just seem really hard to come by, apparently. <sighs> Oh, he does have a friend. I'm gonna get in this bush. I live here now. Okay, where are we? So we've got that little village off to our left, which we didn't explore. There's probably some good loot there. I bet. Okay, so there's that guy. Where's his friend? I hate being outside. Cold, wet, and full 
mosquitoes all biting you in the dick. Okay. Don't know why they'd be biting you there, but. Mosquitoes are kinky, I guess. Okay, we'll, we'll have to come back to that village later. I don't think we can get a good chance to sort of get in without killing people. Ooh, hello. Ooh, hello. Someone's like under arrest? I have to take a leak stone. I hope it hurts, motherfucker. <laughs> Is that all you've got? My babushka slaps harder than you. Real tough guy, huh? But you couldn't pull a trigger back then. I'm not in the business of shooting women and children, you asshole. You sanctimonious <laughs> prick. You came here with us. We were brothers. You were supposed to have my back no matter what. Sorry, Grisha. I'm not a killer anymore. What the hell are you talking about, Kirill? When I finish my contract, I'm going to grow up here. You killed our enemies by the dozen. Okay, well, I've done the objective, so I'm just like, kind of different. cleaning up. You keep telling yourself that, but the truth is you pussied out and deserted us when we needed you. Like a coward. And you will die like a coward. How's my psyche? It hasn't actually dropped that much. Okay. So I think the psyche does actually drop slower the longer the game goes on. Interesting. Thanks. I guess I never expected a stalker to come to my aid. Um, that's when the NAR wants you dead. So what's this really all about? What was this all about? Instead of helping these butchers round up civilians and shoot them, I ran. I couldn't okay. leave the zone because of the perimeter, so I started a little trading operation to get by. Well, it right. didn't take long before my old NAR squad mates found me. Yeah, that's right. He, we used to be friends. We were close, but he couldn't forgive me for abandoning them. I think he was especially bitter about it. I do like that your shit. gunshots don't carry left, super long in this. It's not like I shot and those guys behind me did. are coming up to murder me. Maybe they are. So Grisha know. volunteered to kill me. Okay. Well, you're welcome, I guess. Um, I hope you didn't still kind of like him, because then I feel a bit worse, but he was going to super murder you, so... I suppose that's fine. Yeah, but really cool that it doesn't look like I got... It doesn't look like I got as much psyche loss for that. Which is how it should be. Like, you kill one guy, sure, that, that probably messes you up, right? You kill, like, 30 guys. Feel like you'd be over it. And to be honest, if you're not over it, I don't think you've got, like, a moral leg to stand on at that point. If you've killed, you know, like, in the double digits, and every time you're like, Oh my god, this is affecting me so much. Your life that I will definitely take is... Is making me feel so bad. Oop. Hey you, what's going on? There was an explosion two days ago, and now there are soldiers in Yaniv, and... and... Uh, oh, they're on the train. Fellas. I'm just the driver. They don't tell me anything. But if the army is there, we have to be safe, right? Okay. Oh god, it's gonna be another jump scare or scare scare and thing here. Aha, I'll take that. Nice. Five revolver bullets. Well, that fills me with confidence. Knock, knock. Who's home? Oh, it's another flashback, probably. Oh, it's a clue! This Kozlov guy seems to be important. Perhaps I should meet with him and ask about Tatiana. Okay. Cool. Could be... Could be handy. Anything else in here? Something in there. There's the clue. Okay, there's some stuff outside. I need a lockpick. That's annoying. Ooh. Mechanical. Wow, that's a lot of mechanical parts. 
Okay, so we can go down the road to here. And then we... Okay, down the road, and then we go up to the crashed... Okay, whew. Flashback, I was like, Shit. what was that? I can't shoot a dog. I, I just can't. Look, it isn't easy. I get it. But these animals will die anyways. And in the meantime, they're spreading radiation everywhere. It's a mercy. I just... I can't believe this whole fucking disaster. Someone screwed up. Bad. They should Ooh, have they're gonna be like evil it. dogs in the woods? Let the party leaders handle all of that. We've got our own job to do. Okay. I feel like the game does need some more... I don't know, like... I don't know, like, wildlife hazards, for want of a better word. Because, yeah, I've said it before, like, at the moment the game's about one step above just being a walker mark. Could probably be improved with a bit more... I don't know, I guess it's not supposed to be action heavy, it's very horror heavy. But you know. A little bit of a little bit of action never hurt anyone. Stalker cut a really fine line between action and horror, although Stalker I guess is more like horror and jump scares. Because there's not oh sorry, um action and jump scares. There's not a ton of horror in that game anymore. It's mainly just cheeky jump scares. Not that this game doesn't have any of that, too. Get around. Uh, something over there. Some herb. Now, I think we need... I think we need the mushrooms. Can I actually go this way? Oh, I can. Secret, secret tunnel. Nice. Well, I am being irradiated somewhat. I'm fine. How's my health? Okay, I've taken another heart's worth of radiation. Which is not, not ideal. No engine in that one. Nice. Electronic parts, very nice. I think as soon as we get the opportunity, we should be upgrading our, like, construction thing to the next level. There's a guy there. Doesn't seem bad, or I feel like he would have noticed me. Okay, yeah, it's still there. Hi, buddy. Right, who are you? Who's Semyon. That? Why are you loitering here? Easy. And why are you loitering here? I'm just here? looking for some parts. What? Speak louder. <laughs> God. I'm looking for some parts. Stop yelling. It's not <laughs> safe here. Oh, you're one why of these, are safe? we? What kind of question is that? NKVD, of course. Secret police. NKVD? Yeah. The secret Soviet police? These bastards came around here snooping. They arrested my sister-in-law for being a kulak. And she only has two cows. Two fucking Is this guy cows, a bit senile? The NKVD doesn't exist anymore. You don't need to That's worry right. about them. That's yeah, right. Now it's the KGB. Yes, <laughs> yes your is a piece of shit. His goons are persecuting everyone. Even decorated war heroes like myself. Duh. Right. Oh my. <laughs> what? You've got to speak louder, lad. My hearing is not so good anymore after some Fritz threw a grenade into my bunker. <laughs> do, do you have anything to trade? Perhaps some parts? Why didn't you ask sooner? Of course I do. Of course I'll you trade do. You junk for some bullets. I need to arm myself in case the NKVD comes back. Um, exchange ammo for gear. Did you find anything really valuable? 
Take a look, son. Rifle ammo. Gas mask? Oh, get one gas mask for 10 rifle bullets. One primitive arm for four shotgun slugs. One metal plate for four revolver bullets. Uh, I mean, the gas mask would be best, but... Okay, like what, what scrap you got? For some scrap. Five chemicals, five mechanical parts. Flammable parts are pretty tempting. Yeah, like one shotgun slug. How about we get two? Oh, we can't. Okay. Oh, well, if that's the case, just buy it all. Oh, my God. If we can't, like, cash out. No, that's, that's a way better pick. All right. Hey, Grandpa, want to see a cool trick? Bye. <laughs> want to see, see me open a portal? Want to see me do it again? <laughs> Uh, all right, but base building shit aside, I think we're going to leave this episode here. So guys, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. If you want to see more content from me, the Aussie nerd, feel free to subscribe to my channel. Check out the other videos on there. If you think you know any friends might enjoy my content, make sure you share a video too with them. Really appreciate it. And finally, if you want to leave any hints, tips, tricks feedback for videos, or you just want to say hi, make sure you do so in the comments section down below so I can see it. And I'll see all of you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.